So now let's see how we can work around with the ink to table inside of Microsoft Whiteboard. So in order to work around with that, first of all, let us understand what happens when I use the pen tool. If I were to draw out something right here, nothing happens as of now. You can see that they don't turn into shape or table. In order to make it turn into a table, I can go around over here onto the settings menu and turn on the ink to table feature right here. Once I do that, the ink to table and um, uh, ink to shape and ink to table both get in a, gets enabled out right there. So if I were to draw out a shape now, what happens is that you can see that it has turned into a box. Add in another, mm, uh, another line right here and now it is a table. Similarly, you can click on plus to add in uh, rows right here, plus to add in columns right here. Similarly, you can go around right here and then add in, just draw out to add in more rows as you can see right here. As well you can draw out in the columns as you can see and the uh, the uh, cells the the length of the cells increase out accordingly so that is what you can do right here and this is a table so you can go around press plus minus right here select out individual things right you can go around onto individual columns and click on plus and then it adds around column onto that section right here you can click anywhere you want and click on minus to remove out a row or press plus to add in a row as well. And that is how you can work around with it. You can resize this out as you can see. So you can resize this out. Uh, you can rotate it out and resize it out as with any other images as you can see right there. And that is how you can turn ink to table inside of Microsoft Whiteboard. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe. <laughs>